barbecue sauce, bean sauce. We use it for both. And we have a recipe for that in a video Jennifer does on keto hamming. If you want to check it out. It's almost sugar free. It's used with substitute brown sugar and sugar. The only thing is uh, the molasses has about 14 grams of sugar, so it's really not that sugar free, but it's close. Now we'll stir this all up. Mm. And then dump in the beans. And we'll stir it some more. Get it all worked in. I have more sauce I can add to it. And I have chicken broth. So when this dries, starts to dry out, I can add chicken broth. So it doesn't get all hard and sticky. And it's pretty good right there. So let's go put it over the fire. All right, so now we got a picnic shoulder pork here. We're gonna smoke up and we have two pork bellies, skin still on. And I've never done one of these, so this is gonna be new for me. So, we're going to use our homemade rub. Yeah, we make our own homemade rub too. Just dry it off. Get some rub on this. Yeah, what Jennifer makes this is also in her her keto YouTube keto page on Facebook. All that. It's sugar free too. Now I'm gonna try to keep it off the collar because we're gonna cover the collar up. Try to get it uh, with some nice color on it. I've seen it done, but I've never done it, so this is going to be my first time doing one of these. So we'll see how it comes out. Try to get in there, get this everywhere. Put this nice keto sugar free rub put a little on the bottom don't soak in much there but right, in that collar I'm gonna uh, spray it with a pan I give it a little color and then uh, when we get it in the smoker, we're going to cover it up so it'll be nice and brown. And uh, got the front here. And just hold that flavor in. So that's done. We'll get rid of it and we'll do our pork belly. That's ready for the smoker. Now, pork belly on the skin side. 
we're going to score it because this is gonna this is gonna cook with the uh, deli sada. And when we get done cooking this, this is gonna be just sliced. It's not cured, so it's not bacon. So when we slice it, you fry it in the pan the next day, and it is really, really good. Probably should have sharpened my knife before I started, but that's all right. We just want to get them flavors in there and make sure it gets all the way down in there while it's smoking. Don't want to go too deep because we'll slice it after. Yeah, get it right on in there. So we're getting the beans ready. fire going we're gonna hang it up here and get it started it gets going too fast I'll adjust it put it up too big a fire I'll shove it in the hole and put it on the grate either way the beans are going all right now we got the beans on Now we got the smoker up to 250 degrees. So now we're going to put these on and get them smoking. Nice little sizzle. Shoulder. We're going to uh, spray again. I don't know. I guess the, the collar and the fat below keeps the uh, juices in, and yeah, it's supposed to be a nice golden brown. So we're going to we're going to try it. We're going to put this towel over it to protect it from the raging heat and get it put on just like that. How's that look? Huh? Looks good already. Alright. 
There we go. Now we'll just keep adding some wood. We got some. Uh, we got cherry wood we're putting in. We're gonna smoke it with some cherry. Give it some nice smoke flavor. This one will go into the uh, baked beans. When the beans are done, this one will be sliced up and it'll go into the beans. I'm going to make me a little hole here. We're going to take our apple cider vinegar and we're going to put a little in here. Give a little bit more flavor. And we we'll just wrap it up. And this tin foil always breaks, so we double do it. Double wrapper. Smell good already. Give it a little dose. them back in till we reach 205. And now it's up to 165. Ooh, look at that. Mm. Look at that. Color on that collar. Mm. Alright, now we're going to wrap it up. We're going to wrap it up and let it go to 200. vinegar. Give it a little more moisture. Wrapped up like a Christmas present. Mm. 
Here we go, back on the smoker. All right, the pork belly is done. I'm gonna open it up and see what we got. They've been sitting for about 30 minutes. Ooh, it smells good. Something over there in my fingers. Still all the juice. Cut into it. I'm gonna cut the other way. Look at that. How about that for some nice looking pork? Hmm. I'm gonna cut some of this up and put it in the uh, in the uh, baked beans. Let's, uh, After I try it, of course. Mm. Look how juicy that is. Yeah, there she is. That come out good. That's going to be good in the beans. The beans now are in the smoker with the shoulder. I'll smoke the rest of the beans the rest of the way. Then we'll add some pork to it. It'll be done. Alright, our beans are done. That's gonna be goodness right there. And our pork is done. Smells good. Eight hours on the smoker. Anybody got a dog on a bone? All that's left to do is taste it. Oh yeah. That's it. Time to eat. Oh,